when I return to Let's Play SimCity 4. Okay, we are... yeah, yeah, same thing every time. We are... I'm going to build us a new... Uh, would you stop? New avenue for the second commercial corridor I'd like to build here. So let's go ahead and get started. Um, we're doing... Excuse me. Uh, we're doing poorly uh, with safety, I guess. So uh, I would like to redo a little bit. Oh, oh, before we go any further. Um, so, yeah. Um, here we see toilet papering happening right down the street from the police station. I guess I can probably dispatch some cops here. Let's watch something happen here. No? <laughs> I guess because it's not a terrible crime? You're not going to do anything about it. Okay, well, um, yeah, it, these guys, they, they strike, they don't do anything. I mean, let, let's actually watch now that they're turning down that way. Nope. <laughs> nope. Not doing a damn thing. So, uh, I think uh, the correct solution there is to defund the police and remove that, and then we will just put little kiosks in here and uh, put actual police stations in better places where they will do more good. Anyway, yes, let's get this thing going. Okay. So, probably going to have to do a little destroy to get over there. That's okay. I think this is still the area that I left open. These are two commercial areas. A high wealth commercial office. Interesting. Interesting. Oh, uh, I did notice that we are also seeing uh, some, uh, some 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 high tech industry coming in. Is it because there's still that connection there? We just have to redo this thing altogether? Hmm. What's it gonna take for you? Is it because the sign is in the way? there. Well, we're, we're eventually going to plow out the whole thing anyway. Just not right now. I just want to make this connected here. So that worked out well. We didn't destroy too much. Let's go ahead. And I think I will just fill in this entire neighborhood Get it to go from there. So I guess we got to do the same thing. Just pull it out a little bit, and we're going to be on the outside for that. So now here, if I drag this out, really? There, that's what I'm looking for. It's not what I'm looking for. It's not what I'm looking for at all. I thought it would automatically put in one of these off-ramps, but I guess not. Okay. Now this, I don't know, um, maybe I can make another connection over here, or maybe I can use this to run road along the backside. Might end up running the road along the track as opposed to have it the other way around, but that's fine. And then that way I can at least access it. Um, let's go ahead and also do this with the pipe. So 
let's stop screaming about that. Okay. Well. What else do I want to do with this? Let's go ahead and get these streets hooked up into it. Off there. There. Let's just go the whole distance. That'll also be good because then it'll give me options for where to stick other buildings and the like. Okay, well, uh, let's see. I guess first things first, let's look at our demands. We have a lot of commercial, so let's go ahead and start building some commercial up and along here. Oh, so we will probably want street connector there as well. Good. Okay. Uh, nope, already doing it wrong. There. That one. That one. That one. Okay, we'll give that a little bit. Just I was thinking I'd like to maybe see what a big complex looks like, but then again, maybe not. I don't know how tall these things are gonna be, so maybe let's move this let's move this one right here. Let's see if it develops there. Okay. Um, and then I'm also just gonna fill in a huge amount of this because at this point there's no reason not to. Hey, that works out. But once it actually works out in the direction I want it to. That's not what I want. And we'll get screamed at about expansion and we need more green and all that stuff, but I want to put in parks and whatnot after the fact, even though really it should be as we're doing this because we have to have the expense of eminent domain and tearing down homes and all that stuff, which ends up being uh, a little pricey, but I think that will work, so let's let her go. Do need to be looking at this. Um, some other things though, before we go putting expense on that, let's look at you. So we see the ring here. So we don't have as many students, but we can perhaps affect that by expanding. And that will about there. Oh yeah, yeah, another thing I wanted to do wanted to move the police station. Um, it kind of looks like I've actually got the opportunity for more than one deluxe station, uh, which I was not really anticipating. But thinking about it, I could use that. And I think we'll use it by placing it next to the um, courthouse here. So I'm going to get rid of that. We'll, we'll release the criminals in there, I think is how that actually works. Um, boy, having them come out right on to the one way is not great, is it? It was an issue I had hoped to avoid the first time. Now let's do it fine. So I guess I will recreate our little flower garden thing over here. It actually worked out pretty well find it again. I guess it's the medium one. Yeah. And then what did I do? Pauses. 
I've turned down some of the settings. I may have to turn down more. But I noticed that the, the game is getting really choppy in the recordings. It's not so much when I'm playing it, but it does not like when I move around. Um, it definitely doesn't like when I am doing any of the you drive it missions. Um, just overall, it's, it's a bad deal. So, uh oh, mayor rating is going down now. Why is that? I've given more people more coverage. In fact, now it's pretty much within the boundary of, I think, where everything is going to be. I guess just the opinion poll. Safety has slightly gone up, but it's not overall going up. So were I to put a smaller police station, could even put a large police station in, just a small one. I'm just thinking how I can game this a little bit. If I put one here and put one here, they'd be pretty good for coverage, and then I could put the little kiosks there. I don't need this many police stations, though. And I also have to think that coverage over commercial uh, also benefits them as well, and industrial. I mean, it, it benefits everybody. So, actually, it may be better to kind of have this down here. And then do kiosks around the area. Because we don't, we don't have a crime issue here. I would like to maybe put kiosks in this big neighborhood. So that would be, be getting coverage there. So yeah, why don't we do that? Let's put a police station here. And we will instead come up here. Destroy this one. I better pause this or else people are going to get upset. Pause that one. Destroy that one. That may have impact upon desirability now. Or like this guy. Because, uh, you know, being right next to the police station and a park, I think, was having a, a good effect on this. Change now. So now let's have a look at police kiosk. This is tiny not realize but I guess this will work do it without overlapping on something that would be nice um, what don't we do what do we do like here and then we'll put a tennis court I haven't been putting in a lot of tennis courts and then this block can also have one. Of overlapping there. We can have a little bit of a gap. Same thing, I suppose. This one will put a basketball court. Keep an eye on the youth, uh, who seem to be doing toilet papering a lot. Get another one down here. So now we do have a little bit of an overlap there. Let's bring it down so we don't overlap so much. That. And then we'll do, uh, we'll do a little community garden and a park. Alright, so now cost-wise, we've replaced that police station that was here. 
Now we've increased coverage a bit. Let's see. Oh, right, right, right. Before we allow this to disappear on me too, let's come up here and maybe add a bit more to this. I guess we'll just turn that right into a street. Maybe I should do two. Grab the rail. Now, I don't know how far away I need to be. These ones, if we look, say they have very short freight trips, and that's just because they're right here. I don't know how far away I need to be for the idea of a freight station to be a good idea. It doesn't seem like it's actually being terribly effective. Down in the southern part of this. Um, there. We go look. Like, no one is using this. No one is using this one either. So that means that uh, freight, I mean, freight is short, short trips here. So I guess we've made it efficient enough that it, they just go out, out the sides. And they don't need this, which is okay. I mean, th this one I expect. That one I could probably actually just get rid of the freight station. But this one, this one is kind of in the middle here and. Like everyone, everyone's got a short trip, so I guess I guess this was absolutely unnecessary. Um, it's not really doing anything. Everyone is just taking their freight out. Now, well, I mean, I could kill that connection, but it is already spoken for. Uh, what is not spoken for, though, are these two connections. Because uh, those go down into the undeveloped land so far. However, there's no reason not to do that, so I guess we will just... Falling into that. So, yeah, these things, I mean, they're only taking up 10 small ends. That's not too terrible. I guess I can keep them, but I was kind of expecting that to. I mean, if you're right next door to a freight station, why wouldn't you just take it there and then let the train take it? But maybe we don't have enough destinations along rail to make it consider that. I don't know. Anyway, get back on track here, letting this game go. Immediately see development here, that's good. See good development here too, by the look of it. What is the outdoor restaurant? Flea market. Flea market coming in, okay. Uh, low wealth commercial services, oh. So they're, they're not really. Bob's grease pit. Okay, they're the, they're the usuals. But yeah, I wanted to show, like out here, uh, we're getting a couple high techs right now, semiconductor factories out here, which is pretty fantastic. It means that pollution is going to go away, but it also means that we have the education going on to fill the needs of some of those jobs so uh, speaking of why don't we come in here let's find old old Gaz here he's got no complaints now he's happy um, I was gonna put in a private school up in this neighborhood we'll hold off on that for a minute since he's not complaining about it probably because he's in his 50s now and it's a little late for him his education has gone up though so maybe he's been visiting the library or something he's still the general manager at flights um, which, I don't know, like, his his trips show him being here. So why don't we actually give him a chance for a new job? Um, I guess I guess to pick? At talent management? Be the CEO of the talent management? Or how about Melon Inc.? Let's go here. Happily hums hi-ho over a new job. He's now CEO of Melon Inc. Okay. 
Just like that. Just like that. Okay. Hmm. I would have expected just a little bit more fanfare for that, but whatever. It works. Okay. Uh, back, back, back. Still got plenty of this. So, why don't we fill in the cracks downtown here. Just keep it going. In fact, I may have completely underestimated. Nah, we don't need that. In fact, we've got plenty of space now. We've been burning a lot of it. Causing another potential conundrum. Um, we might actually want to start importing from the place down below. Uh, because what happens when we run out of trash? Then what? We're relying on this energy. I mean, we're at 84% capacity in the city. It seems to be pretty stable, though. So maybe between <coughs> the recycle center and that, we've got enough trash that we are sustaining our little energy cycle here. That's fine. Be more than pleased with that. No connection. That makes no sense. I really don't understand that. I think it'll go away eventually, but it just... How on earth can you say that? we're doing here. Okay, we need a little bit more funding. Oh, too much. It is very touchy, isn't it? How about you? Yeah, it's, uh, it's going up a little bit. Just a very minuscule amount, but it is. How about hospital? Ooh, we need more funding there. How come no one's been screaming at me about more funding? Doing well there. All the gains I'd made in my treasury, though, have been disappearing. The opinion on safety is going up, though, so that's good. How's uh, our crime situation? Doesn't seem to actually be taking any of it away. How's our graph on crime? Hey, okay. So number of arrests has gone down dramatically. I wonder if that's because I got rid of that station here. The number of crimes has also go d gone down, so maybe correlation is causation? Maybe? I don't know. Maybe number of arrests is... Well, hmm. I, I think that even though the kiosk doesn't take prisoners, I think it's still... So there's been two crimes here and no arrests. So they can make arrests, but then I think it gets transferred to the nearest station. Because they don't have jails, so or jail cells. So it would be here. That's 16 inmates. I don't know. I don't know how to explain that. All right, I guess the game is prepared now for me to fill in all of the commercial, so we shall do so. Oh, right, uh, another thing. Um, off camera, I had managed to get... Where are you? TV station. Um, this was for doing... I think a police helicopter mission is how I managed to get my hands on this one. So, why don't we put you here? Sure, we'll put you where the old police station used to be. Eye in the sky. Um, why don't we get rid of this? 
But I'll keep the spirit and just put in a larger one. There. That's something you'd see. I guess this is Sim TV. I don't know what the station is. Um, shall we? Yeah, give it a try. Why not? Cover the hostage crisis. What is the alternative? Get the perp story. Uh, I think this one gives me something, so let's actually do this. Uh, E. Oh, damn. <laughs> I, I guess, I guess, uh, the building was a little too tall for me. That's unusual. Go up a little bit. to see this his mom on TV get the chopper over to the guy's mom's house before he does something drastic. Hooray. I didn't unlock anything. Alright. Well, never mind. Uh, how's the industry? Good. Perhaps we could justify industry popping in elsewhere? Do you want to take... Should I risk demolishing more and hoping it rebuilds as manufacturing? Because it is supposed to handle that on its own, it just doesn't seem to be. And I don't really know why I'm keeping this gap here. I would eventually like to move forward with it. Here, slow this down. Plaza in there. Why don't we take a risk? That is not the right one. Take a risk. Put that in there. Let's hope it turns into manufacturing. If it does, it will keep the pollution back here. In fact, if I could take this whole front strip, I might be able to take the air pollution behind the avenue here, which would actually be really nice. Opinion is just about the police coverage. On and on, on and on. It's not really developing, is it? Okay, we are seeing a little bit of a crunch on that. We are now seeing more demand for medium wealth in the residential areas. So, that. Damn it, it's dirty. Do some manufacturing. Well, that's manufacturing. Did I have the wrong thing? Okay, that's manufacturing too. Good. There's a zone back there for no reason. Fire protection a little short. You got areas that aren't covered. You're, sh you're showing me this area that I, I literally have a police or a firehouse in. Well, I know. Um, I'm very bad about fire coverage. But they also don't seem to be complaining. Um, this is actually a pretty bad neighborhood. 
And maybe I should get another little firehouse over here. I don't know, my problem with SimCity is that it does not scale to what I consider to be appropriate or a any need, really. I mean, 20,000? I don't feel like I should need that many places. Now let's get it done. Um, in fact, why don't we just go ahead and maybe put it here on the road out? Because then it could also cover a little bit of that if I raise the funding on it, maybe. Uh, I don't think that's how that works on this. It's a little bit different, isn't it? I mean, really, then, we'd be better off putting it down here. Just have it... Mm. Have it move up and over if the neighborhoods ever catch fire. Probably a smarter idea. Put that there. Preemptively put a plaza there. I think I'm going to risk getting rid of these things. And it works. Because we are looped around and connected. Now when I drive this highway through here, that may be another issue. But that's for another time. Okay. Already seen some good stuff show up here. More commercial. We got another thing going on here. In that case, we may wish to continue with the kiosks. some more there. Let's hook up these streets here. Let's see what that eventually does to traffic. I don't need to put down more residential yet. We've got plenty here. It just needs to develop. Okay, now we've completely killed <laughs> all, all that demand. We do still see agricultural demand, though. And that may be necessary. Um, in that case, I suppose, next time maybe we should go down south, finally finish developing that little region hook up the, the river figure out where the highway and the rail are going to go sort of take off from there I think I'm also going to fill in that so aside from this part we've got most of this filled in now with the commercial center which is good Let's go ahead and come back in here, uh, control all shift, get you uh, two brush. See, we're actually painting over trees. So I guess that's sort of the downside of using this as opposed to planting trees. Okay, that one came out nice. Sort of getting randomness here. It's making it go away. Why are you making it go away? This street. This street is having traffic jams. Okay, well, that is probably true, and in fact, maybe let's lower that down. Um, you probably have connecting roads 
along all these. I guess I should. What are you? Freedom of expression, that guy again. I mean, yeah, yeah. If we look at traffic, it's all on these streets. So I guess. It would make more sense, anyhow, to have the industrial side of this. Roads, I mean, we got this and this, but these are temporary. We'll eventually get rid of them. Uh, back to my tree planting? Back to my tree planting. I wonder, what if I do a level 4 brush here? Not really doing anything. There. Yeah, I don't know. It it does put large clumps in, and then it also takes them away. It's actually kind of frustrating what it's doing. working. Sort of. I want to see land value. Okay, overall it's very high land value in general. Unfortunately, uh, unlike in previous Sim Cities, land value is not a determining factor for much anymore. I guess desirability? This is iffy as well. You don't learn much by this. And mayor rating is going down. Okay. You see it's not doing too well over here at all, in fact. Um, is that because it is undeveloped? Well, there you go. Doesn't count for much, then, does it? Let's look at the actual mayor rating. Uh, it's pretty, pretty same. Okay. All right, that is filling in there. And now we're driving demand again in a new cycle because of all the new people. All right. Well, eventually, uh, I think we're going to need an elementary school out here somewhere because education that is the wrong one education yeah like this isn't anything we got a library out here but uh so i i'm going to need at least a, a small elementary school probably out here like i said i do want to put a private school up here just to use those because apparently you can get more than one i think you can get up to five um there's several buildings like that. I think there's like four cemeteries and something else. Anyway, um, so like expanding education for sure uh, would be a good idea into these areas. Um, I think we can see what it's doing here. So that's really good. Uh, not so much here. We need a, that's a museum, maybe a library up in here. I don't know. But, uh, yeah, I think that if we start tailoring these things... Okay, just back into here. Yeah. That's gonna happen. Um, if we start tailoring more of these things, I think that this will be better. This part of town loves me, I guess, for some reason. Gaps and police coverage, we're always going to have that. Okay, but yeah, now they're, they're asking again uh, for more parks and more everything, and uh, 
We're still having issues here. Um, I, I guess I'd like to put in um, bus stops over in this area of town. That might help out. Look at traffic in this. Oh boy. Stadium. All right. Of course, it's not going to fit in one of my blocks. Um, traffic is what I was looking for. It's not too bad. I mean, it's bad here, but otherwise, not so much. Probably alleviate a lot of that with buses here. Um, but definitely, maybe on this side, putting buses in here. I don't know. Uh, we'll get to it. And really, if I just upgraded all the streets to roads, it would take care of everything. We don't have that kind of traffic in here yet, which is pretty amazing. But I... Just for the sake of it, do not want to do that. Although, I think I'm, I'm being stupid by keeping it the way I'm doing it here. Uh, if I did have that mod, the traffic mod, which would send everybody to the roads and maybe get off the streets, then keeping streets would have some justification, but right now I, I don't see that. We're actually going backwards on this. But anyway, uh, we're slowly creeping out here to the edge of this and then we've got to go up here but i think next time maybe we'll go down uh try and finish up the southern sector here what do we got up here i think there's one patch here and then there's another patch here that i think is like right there well it'd be it'd be at the half point which would be here so we could develop a few more of the outer territories, I suppose. Maybe try harder and harder to push the ag demand away. Anyway, I'll end this one here. I'll see you next time.